What's up, everybody? Welcome to Mountain Grove 406. Got a moment for you. So everybody's talking about char cloth right now online. We're going to go ahead and talk about it real quick. And I'm going to tell you what. It ain't nothing if you ain't carrying the proper stuff with it. Two small containers. One's got some char cloth and some tinder, which is just some light, dryer lint. And then I got, uh, huh? I'll show you what I got in this one. So got a piece of paper so I can do some collection. And I've got one of these. So you got a striker and some magnesium. And I got the striker. But real quick, we're going to go ahead right here. So there you go. I got some char cloth right here and some dry lint right here. Oh, give me another minute and I'm going to go ahead and show you something. So we're just going to go ahead and take a piece of that. You don't got to use all of it. I'm going to use some dry lint real here. Let's see if I can get this on camera. So I've noticed one thing about these and these strikers. Give me a moment here. This slick side it's slick so you get a little sparky but not as much as turning it around and using the other side and you get lots of lots of sparky so we're going to go ahead and use that oh right there you can see right there i already did just one little spark that's all that took but now we're going to use this dryer lint to go ahead and get that And then if we wanted to, I could have took some of this magnesium and I could have got it in the paper and then dumped that on there. Well, good this minute. Here we go. Oh. There we go. Check that out. Well, we could take this. We could put this in our bigger tinder bundle and go ahead and let that burn. You guys have a nice day. Hope you learned something.